Hello everybody, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I know, I know it has been a long time. I tried to film an apartment um, shopping vlog, but it's just been taking too long to edit it because all the footage was on my phone. So anyway, we're going to fast forward to an empty apartment tour. So I am living on campus this semester. Well, this year, it is required for us to live on campus. Um, do I think we're going to be here long? Absolutely not. But I did get placed in an apartment, and I'm so, so excited for that. Also, right now, I don't have a roommate. The roommate that I was supposed to have isn't actually coming in the fall, um, and I have not been assigned a second roommate yet. So because of that, I currently have the apartment all to myself, which means I get first pick at my room and different things like that. So... Anyway, today's video is going to be an apartment tour and then possibly a move-in. I don't know if I'm going to make that a separate video. Today's also not my official move-in day. It's called like a stop and drop where we're coming to just leave our stuff, move in a little bit, but we can't like actually stay here afterwards. But we, we're allowed to move all the furniture around and do whatever we need to do. So right now we are currently working on bringing stuff in because I did come with my boyfriend. But other than that, um, I'm going to give you guys a tour, set up a couple of things, and then make a list of what I need to go get before my actual move-in day on the 24th. So... That's what we're doing right now, and I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a little apartment tour. But I do need his help. He's just using the bathroom right now. So, um, I guess, well, no, I guess I could show you guys on my own and it be like a classic room tour style. So, I will tell you guys right now, my school apartment is very, very dated. It is not even like, it's so ugly, it's kind of like cute, you know? Okay, anyway, that's all. So, let's move this around. So when you walk in, this is my front door right here. Sorry, it's not really like in focus, but this is my front door um, and it has a little eye hole that I probably wouldn't even be able to reach. But anyway, when you walk in, oh, <laughs> this is what you see. So this way, this is the first bedroom. It's bedroom A and all the furniture is still in here. This one literally has no windows. The other room is absolutely like identical, basically. That leads to the bathroom. This is closet one, closet two, and then the bookshelf was right here. So then behind this door is just like the AC unit and whatever, and then in here is my actual like um, closet, if you will, and this is where we're just moving this stuff in um, as like a holding spot. So to give you reference, that was all of like this little cubby area right here. So if you keep coming down the hallway, you enter into the living and dining space. So that's like my little patio. I don't, it's not gated because I have a ground apartment, but this is what it looks like in here. Not very cute at all. <laughs> then this is the room that I'm actually going to keep because it has two big windows in here. The bookshelves on the wall and not by the door. Um, so here's bed number one and number two. Then it has two smaller desks. I had these in my freshman dorm room um, in the first hall I stayed in. And then it has a little bookshelf here, which is super cute. And this will work for like um, my Etsy shop and different things like that. Then we have my two closets. So there's one here and one over there. The cool thing about this is that the mirror is inside of the closet. So I don't have to worry about bringing my own. And then it has a cute little nightstand. So again, I don't have a roommate, so I get to keep both closets. Then... Um, connecting the two bedrooms is the bathroom, so this is what it looks like in here. Very plain, I don't know why the doors are like green. But here is the shower with a little mini tub, and then the room with the toilet. So that's what the bathroom looks like. And now the only thing we have left is the kitchen. So if you walk back out to this room, you see my lovely boyfriend again. But here is the little kitchen where we started the video out so it has like the full stove the full fridge comes with a microwave a ton of cabinet space um the sucky thing is that my window leads out to like the courtyard and i'm not trying to have other people see me but we are just going to continue bringing stuff in um again i don't know how much i'm gonna show you guys in this video i guess i can like i don't know but that was a quick, really quick empty apartment tour okay so i don't think i'm gonna film this stuff as i'm setting it up <laughs> but I'll show you guys what it looks like after. So we just did the bathroom, but I did notice that some of the soap that I brought in this bag spilled all over other stuff in the bag, but it's okay because that's why it was in a plastic bag. But to begin, 
we decided to put my cute little rug here. It's very small, but I also have this shower curtain as well as that little toilet mat. The door doesn't really close with the toilet mat there, babe. They could see you in the mirror. The door won't close with the toilet mat there, but since it's just me in the apartment for right now, that door doesn't even need to close because there's two other ones to make the bathroom like sealed. So that's the bathroom for now. Anything else that's going to go in there is like cleaning products um, and a little hand dispenser or soap dispenser that I have. But I think next we are going to tackle the kitchen because the kitchen too is just putting stuff away. It should be really easy and cute. So I'll show you guys what that looks like after. But again, here's my little kitchen. Probably gonna have to buy some contact paper because that counted out ugly. Okay, so I finished everything that I'm gonna do today in my apartment. I'm trying to avoid the kitchen because there is a big old spider and it's not moving I know it's alive because it was not there earlier so I'm scared to go that way but anyway you guys have already seen the bathroom so I decided that I would show you guys my room next so they did leave both sets of furniture in here so I just hung up my tapestry um, let me focus this really quick I did hang up my tapestry as well as put the two beds together right here um, it does take up a lot more space than I thought but it still leaves a lot of room so on the bookshelf over here, I just put this um, Just Beachy sign. I don't know what else I'm going to put. I kind of want to get some plants and whatnot, but we'll just see. Um, in there, I just put some uh, detergent, my detergent or whatever, and I hung up the clothes that I did bring today. Other than that, the other big thing I did was my corner desk. So I picked this window for lighting, especially for my budgeting videos and whatnot, but I brought this desk from the second room and took the other black one over there. Um, and then this bookshelf was already in here, so I just put the extra chair in the hallway closet. But that is what this space looks like, and there is a ton of room between that and my bed, so I'm not worried about that. So that is my little bed area. Um, then if we come to the living area, I did move around the living room furniture just a bit, so... I'm not sure how I like this setup yet, but I was trying to angle this chair to where I could still see the TV, which has to go on that because the cable little cord is over there. Um, coffee table still in the middle, and then I brought the couch a little bit off of the wall just because I didn't want everything against like one of the four walls. Then over here, I did kind of shift the table a little over um, to kind of fit more in that crevice that the living area space had. So that's what I did, and then I moved the trash can over here just because I thought it would be too close to the table and I don't want to put it back because of that flipping spider right there on the floor. You see it? That thing, that sucker's huge. So I'm scared to go over there. Um, but yeah, so that's this area. And then the kitchen is all done. I did hang um, some cute towels that I purchased from Target up there. As well as I filled that with hand soap. That's my dish soap, uh, my dish rack. All of the dishes are on this side of the kitchen. Just, uh, just because since the dish drying rack is right there, it would be easier to put the stuff away. Then I'm going to come around the table because I'm not trying to go into the kitchen. Because of that stupid spider. But over there, if you can see, I do have the mittens and the little like pot holders as well as the same cute towel on the stove and there's nothing hiding back there just like a box of pots and stuff so you're not really missing out but that is everything that is in my apartment right now the time is 10:23, and I have to be out of here by 10:30 because my time was at 9 o'clock and we had a 90 minute slot so that's all I'm gonna be able to do today I hope that you guys enjoyed watching this little stop and drop move in process this is my view from outside like from my little balcony um, it's just some trees and a cute little like yard I guess so this is my little patio I think I'm gonna ask if I can bring like a DIY fence and kind of block this off um, just so I can have plants out here and feel a little more comfortable about someone not taking my stuff or coming up to my door because I don't know how to properly lock this one and then the only way I lock the front door is like a button which isn't super safe and I don't feel like very comfortable having just that but I mean everyone else was fine I guess when they lived in this apartment so that is everything that I have for you guys today I hope you enjoyed I will 
film again on my actual moving day just because a lot more things will be happening then. So that is everything. Again, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a big ol' thumbs up. Please leave me some college content that you want down below, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.